Rather Good Coaching presents. Hello, I'm Karen Adams of Rather Good Limited, and today I want to talk to you about feedback. I recently shared an article on LinkedIn from Harvard Business Review that gave five steps to effectively turning bad feedback given badly into something that you find personally useful. It went kind of viral. A lot of people are obviously interested in this, but I don't want to regurgitate what was in the post or in the article. There's a very good article about it on Harvard Business Review and I thoroughly recommend you read it. I'll link to it below. Anyway, so this is actually more about how an overview that's easy to remember. It's not a five-step process, it's not anything in particular. It's just how to best approach feedback from other people. Because frankly, when other people tell us something, give us feedback about something that we've done, it doesn't always feel great. When they're telling us that they don't like something, it kind of feels like a personal attack fairly often. Often, when I give personal criticism, and I suspect when you give personal criticism, it's intended to be helpful. You're not actually doing it just to be a dick. You're doing it because you genuinely have spotted something that you think someone else could do better. When someone else tells me that same criticism, when someone else gives you that same criticism, I tend to assume, and I imagine you do, that it is a personal criticism. The other person doesn't know where I'm coming from, doesn't know why I did something, and I feel kind of attacked by that. The thing is, knowing that someone probably didn't mean to be a dick when they said it, because if I said it, I probably wouldn't mean to be so, taking what you can from that taking what they've said, divesting yourself of any emotional attachment to anything they've said, run through it and see if realistically any of that fits against your experience. They've said something, does it actually chime with what you did? Or does it help you have a different perspective on what you did? Because sometimes it actually helps us to see how someone else saw what we did. So if someone tells me that they didn't like something I did and they think it was a bad choice, perhaps it was a bad choice and I wasn't seeing it from that perspective so I might know better and can adjust what I do in the future. Perhaps I'm doing something that I didn't bother to explain to somebody else and therefore it was taken as inappropriate or badly thought out when it actually wasn't. My problem was communicating. My problem was not what I actually chose to do. Bearing these things in mind and taking that on board in that way is most helpful. It can help us to learn and do better in the future. It can also help us not getting annoyed about people who are probably trying to help us even if they're not going about it in the best way. So next time someone gives you feedback, take a step back, avoid taking it personally, take on board what seems useful, get rid of the stuff that doesn't. And if people say something in a way that's particularly offensive, maybe give them some feedback. Maybe say that the way they mentioned something made it kind of hard to listen and really understand and adjust to what they were saying that they had a valuable point, and that you're really glad that they said it, but it actually took you a while to take it on board. And when someone else knows that we valued what they said and we took the effort to take on board what they said, maybe they'll take on board the fact that we want more feedback in the future and we'd like it in the easiest way possible. So we may also be doing someone else a service down the line, not only the person providing the feedback who might find an easier way to communicate, not only ourselves who may not actually have such poorly delivered feedback in the future, 
but also for other people who get the opportunity to receive that feedback in a more approachable way. Okay, so give me a like if you enjoyed that. Subscribe if you want more helpful information of a similar nature. Uh, comment or contact me at rathergoodcoaching.com if you want to know more. Take care. Cheerio!